Hey everybody, uh, my name's Ricky. My name is Janelin. <laughs> this is a video that a lot of people have requested. They wanted to know how we met. Um, so we thought we'd uh, sit here and tell you how we met. We went looking for a place today to, with a different background and we apologize about the background noise. We are right here side of a uh, hardware store. So there's a lot of big trucks coming back and forth by here and plus TVs in the background, things like that. But we apologize in advance for that. So, um, give you a little bit of backstory on, I'll let you go first. You want me to go first? Okay. Go first. Um, a little bit of backstory on me. Uh, when I met Junalyn, I was not in a good place. But I became in a good place very soon. Was <laughs> after I met her, that is. But one night I was at my house and I was just scrolling through TikTok, looking at videos, laughing and stuff like that. And I ran across this uh, website called Philippine Cupid. <laughs> Don't recommend it. <laughs> <laughs> but I was just scrolling through and looking at the people that were in it and just listening to the two people talk and what the website's about is it hooks Filipino women up with foreigners so I was just sitting there looking through it listening to uh, the foreigners talk to the Filipino women see if they could connect and I ran across the Junalyn's profile and I clicked on it and then I looked at it yeah I stalked <laughs> I kind of excuse me I kind of just looked at uh, her TikTok profile and I After that thought, message. well I'll get to that in a second, <laughs> I um, clicked on her and I said, hey beautiful, you want to talk? She didn't reply, you know, instantly. <laughs> then she came back, what, what was it, like a day later? Yeah, I think a day later. A day later. A day later, so, and then we, we it was kind of a hit and miss kind of thing. Hey, how was your day? good morning kind of thing like that and uh, probably after about a week then we started talking and we did a video chat because we wanted to make sure that each of us were real not scam. <laughs> yeah not a scam <laughs> that was one of the biggest things that scared us was this might be a scam and then after that I use a filter yeah filters a funny filter oh yeah funny filter with a long nose and I thought that was hilarious <laughs> and I love humor so <laughs> That was a that was a plus there right off the bat, and let's see. We talked and DC'd a lot after that, and she went to Saint Bernard to be with her teacher friend. Joselle. Yeah, Joselle. And was, I immediately, huh? That was December. That was December. We started. We yeah. met December the twenty fourth. Yeah, we we went in Cebu that time in December. I think we celebrate Christmas in Cebu that time. Yeah, you and yourself. Yeah, and then we went in the church. Saint yeah, tell Pierre. them that. We went Speak in that. We went in the church, San San Antonio. I think, if I'm not mistaken, the name is San Antonio. We went there. My mom, Giselle, she went there because she prayed a lot for for her husband to pass a word exam for a police and then she and then her prayer is what's the name? answered yeah answered and then she said when her aunt when her prayer was answered it's okay babe. It's right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. no go ahead and then when her when her prayer answered she said, I will back here and then say thanks for everything and then I asked her why why you here and she said all my prayers is fulfilled and then I did not believe that time and then she said, just try and then I tried to pray about man <laughs> and then I prayed a lot I prayed a lot that I prayed like I, w I hope I can find a man that Hmm? Speak up. You've been sweeping. Okay, it's alright. You're doing good. She's doing good, right? <laughs> go <ahead>. I'm sweeping. <laughs> it's hot. And then, after that, like, after I prayed, I think, weeks? I think, yeah. yeah it's I think it's at two weeks. Yeah, two weeks. Yeah. I messaged her on TikTok. Yeah, TikTok. I'm 
there's a lot of men message me that time but I ignore because there's a lot of scammers that time they send a lot of pictures bad pictures yeah <laughs> And a lot of the pictures that they sent her were fake pictures with filters and then when she saw who they really were, they didn't look like their pictures they had sent before. And then they'd ask her, how'd you like my picture? <laughs> and then I, I block. <laughs> and then I, I'm not interested that time. And then Mom Giselle told me, you're better to wait than to rush to looking for somebody. Like, you don't know. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and then, well, we'll follow up here. Um, I went ahead and booked a trip here in March, wasn't it? Yeah, March. Yeah, March. I came here in March, and we met for the first time at Cebu Airport, which you can see that video down below, uh, meeting my LDR for the first time. And we met at the airport, and we. she also said that when she met the person that she prayed for, she wanted to go back to the church and yeah. give thanks. Yeah, we go back there, babe. Yeah, and we went back to the church and to give thanks, you know, the prayer answered, more yeah, or less. The prayer answered. I mean, I was definitely not, we, me, neither one of us were looking for anybody, but in a way we were, and then we got put together. And I'll tell you, it's, it's just been great. You ever, you ever heard that song on TikTok? There's nothing in the world like a Filipino girl? That is true. <laughs> That's very true. And then after our first trip here came to an end, I went back to my place and I was there for six months. But right after I got home, I went ahead and booked my next trip here, which is now. And I am here now till January, the in between the 1st and the 12th. I don't know, I haven't decided what day I'm gonna go back yet, but I am going back in January. And we're going to go from, we're in Bohol right now. We started in Cebu. We're in Bohol right now. We're going to go to Sticky Whore, the 31st. Yeah, 31st. We're going to stay there maybe a week or two. And then we're going to go to Shargao. And then my place. And then her place, which is uh, Southern Leyte. Southern Leyte. We're going to go, yeah, I said Southern Leyte. <laughs> <laughs> and then we're going to go down to uh, her parents' house for Christmas. They wanted us to come there first before we went anywhere, but... Yep. We had already had plans to come here. Yeah, we already booked. Yeah, we had already booked. And, but, I mean, that's pretty much how we met. We met on TikTok, but I do recommend Christian Filipina. If you want to meet a nice lady, a nice Filipina, go to Christian Filipina. The link is in my bio, and I'll also have it linked to this video. Uh, it is, some people tell me it's, it's pricey, but it is pricey because they... They make sure that the scammers are not on there. You may run across nothing's perfect, believe me. You may run across one or two scammers that's on it. You never can tell. Some of them do seep through the cracks, more or less, how we say in the United States. <laughs> but uh, Christian Filipina is a great place to meet a person. I didn't meet my Filipina on there, but I do know a lot of guys that have met their Filipinas on there, and some of the other vloggers that I watch, they met theirs on there, and they not they're married now they've been together five or six years but like I say the link is in my bio go on there and check it out you can subscribe click to my link there it helps us out it helps the channel and I do want to ask y'all I do want to ask y'all I am trying I'm only at 1896 subscribers right now I am trying to grow my page so I can make way to stay here and just video but I'm asking y'all to share the video, give it a thumbs up, push the video as much as you can, help us out, grow the channel, subscribe, hit the notification button, like, give us thumbs up, thumbs down, both of them. Either one you give us, it don't matter because both of them count. YouTube don't know the difference. But um, is there anything else you want to <laughs> add or anything like that? <laughs> Isn't she gorgeous? <laughs> anything else you want to add? No. Okay. I hope that we answered all the questions of what people wanted to know about us um, or what we want to share, I'll put it that way, about how we met. Um, some things we, we're not going to share, some things we may share if you ask us. But if we don't, and we're, we'll give you a, a thumbs up, we're not going to ignore your comment or anything like that. But if we don't feel like we want to share that part, we just won't answer or we'll say thank you for watching or something like that not being rude by no means because we appreciate y'all we really do don't we mm -hmm.
you couldn't do it without you. <laughs> and, uh, but I think we're going to end the video here. I know it's not a very long video, but and I, I really hope that we explained or you know how we met. Now we met on TikTok, Filipina Cupid. Cupid. Yeah. And that that website is still up, I do believe. But we don't go to it. <laughs> okay. Nah, we don't mess with it. But, but until next time, uh, keep a, keep watching and keep a lookout for our next video. And we love y'all. 